the following day. Hi guys, yesterday I totally screwed up two entire video recordings because the audio failed, it went bad. And the reason for this is normally I have the GoPro Hero 2 on my chest. I used to use this one, but I had a couple of problems with this one. So I got myself another microphone and this one, it comes with the Osmo. It's, it's, it's a Rodas, which you can order from TGI. Tested audio was good. I have the Hook 3D audio, best quality, but you have to attach it like this and that and such and so. And the biggest disadvantage is you need to charge it. I had this incident where after three flights it ran out of battery. And now this, this hook audio is beeping in my ear. And that sucks because when I'm in a recording you don't want to, to run something like this out of battery. So I can only use this like two times and then I should choose something else. So yesterday I thought, okay, the other microphones, the recordings went well, so um, let's try this one again, quick and dirty and simple and easy. And if it turns out to fail, I will always have another audio recording as a backup. But I didn't first. I stopped recording with the NVIDIA Shield because the DJI GO app is freezing all the time and I don't want it to freeze, I want it to function normally so I said, you know what, let's not record the screen and skip that video but when I skipped that video, I also skipped my backup audio track that automatically records when I have the transmitter and everything Disadvantage of this audio recording is, is that when there's wind, you will hear it. But at least it's a backup. And then I used the Osmo and on the first video I failed to turn on the Osmo because I had to change batteries. And that meant the only audio I had was this one. And that one failed. Meanwhile, because of this audio troubles that I'm having, I need to do a test just to figure out for once and for all what the thing is. So I'm going to do two tests. I'm going to record a bunch of audio with the GoPro and the different microphones and compare it. There was an update on the DJI GO 4 app before I went to Cyprus. So I may want to try again with the screen recording and the latest DJI GO 4 app, whether the screen still freezes or not. Ten seconds later. So here's this thing. I'm gonna put this one on. Record, one, two, three, four, test, 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 record. Hello, hello, hello. And now I will be turning and moving this thing and what's going on. Later. So I'm gonna... You see? This is exactly the problem. Flashback. Twelve seconds later. Take two with the big microphone. Hello, hello, hello. Take two with the big microphone. Okay. Hello, this hello, hello. So much test, better. Test, test, What is going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom, boom. Da, 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 da. Okay. This is a test. How is this audio? Now with the hook. Now with the hook. This is standard Hero 2 audio. You can see what I mean. Like, like I have this thing and now I have to figure out like, okay, like this. Oh no, I better first put in the plug. I better turn it on right away. So it's red, so it's on. Shouldn't it be blue? Whatever. And then I have to do this, and this, and this, and this, and this. 
So you see, it's a little bit, a little bit, it's just more complicated. Now I hear a beep in my ear. Why do I hear a beep? Hello, hello, hello. This is a test, Rook 3 audio. What's going on? Yeah, I'm moving in the field. I'm This is a test, Rook 3 audio. What's this going is good on? Tune. Yeah, I'm moving in the field. I'm... I think when I hear this beep, it means like the battery level is... Now it should be coming again. No. It disconnects. I just charged it all night. Oh, okay. When it's beeping, it means it's losing connection. So it means the battery is already down again. Anyway, there is a test to see how the quality is. Okay. So blah 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 blah. Good enough for me. Stop recording, and now I'm gonna load this into the computer. So blah 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 blah. Good enough for me. Wow. Um, it has nothing to do with Hook 3D audio, it's just uh, the connection. I think I think this either this plug is just really bad. Mm. I think the, the combination of, of this one and this one is especially bad, but probably the plug inside is uh, not good. Mm. What am I gonna do about that? You know, it can just be like because you use it a hundred times, it, it, it doesn't make a good connection anymore. I'm in trouble. Because if I cannot do this reliably, well, what am I gonna do? Okay, I have to solve this problem. I'll think about it. Much later. Wait a minute, there's a microphone jack in here. Are you kidding me? It means I could put a microphone in here. Really? So many options, so many possibilities. A few minutes later. So this is a small test to see if I can put another microphone on here. Uh, this is the microphone from the Osmo and it fits perfectly well. This one is the Polar Pro one, but I cannot get it in here, it's too tight. As you can see, like, like this, you see? Then this big one, of course it fits because it only has a small plug, but I cannot attach this thing somewhere on here. So actually, this small one is pretty perfect and it has a wind cap. So now, let's see if I can do a small recording and see how the audio is. This is the audio from the NVIDIA Shield with the Osmo microphone. Test, test, test. Is it going all right, guys, or what? This is the audio from my Panasonic camera. This is the audio from the Osmo. This is the audio from the NVIDIA Shield with the Osmo microphone. Isn't this a wonderful world? <laughs> Moments later. This is the audio from my Panasonic camera. This is the audio from the Osmo. This is the audio from the NVIDIA Shield with the Osmo microphone. When I hear this, I would say that um, the audio from, from the Osmo with the big microphone is the best. The microphone from the Panasonic is very good too, but it has no windshield, so very often this is not an option. The audio from uh, the Shield with the little Osmo microphone is pretty good, but not as uh, loud. As, as you would want it to be and you can you can see that like here like this is from the Panasonic this is from the Osmo and this is from the Shield with the Osmo microphone so you, you can see that this is full level this this is not full level 
So that means that I have to push up the volume and that you will hear more noise, more background noise when I use this audio. You know, now that we are here, maybe I can try one more thing. Like, how is this going on the Osmo? So, actually, I'm gonna unplug this. I'm gonna put that one in there. So now, because it's it this is this is such a big thing, you know. So let's let's see. This is the audio from the Osmo and the Polar Pro microphone that gives me so much trouble on the Hero 2. We will find out very soon. One minute thirty-seven seconds later. How is this going on the Osmo? And then, uh, as you can see over here, I, I unplug it, I put it in, and the audio is completely gone. There's nothing. So this one is dead. I gotta throw it away. The next day. And then I know, okay, there is a connection between... And now, the hook starts to beep again. I cannot work with this. So I'm I'm gonna put this away. I still have the Osmo microphone, so I'm gonna put the Osmo microphone in here and hope that will be good enough. Anyway, I hope you like my test. See you on the next video.